so here it's a new game. It's about a special structuring. So you have a big picture with a table, a chest of drawer, and a boy. And then you have a small picture. You have shoes, flower, bag, balloon, and a cap. And then you have big picture. So I just printed two, but you have more. So for example, you take this one. Your child has to put um, the picture like on the small picture. So for example, you would put it here, here, here. But the problem is that your child doesn't uh, say where it is, he just puts. So what I want is him to explain where he put the picture. So I put the shoes on the table. I put the balloon on the floor in front of the table. I put the flower on the chest of drawer. I put the bag in front of the chest of drawer. And I put the cap on uh, the, 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 on the boy on, the, on his face. And you do it for other pictures. It's important for the child to explain where it is so that it will use the word and you will know if you know where it is, if you know it, where it's in front, where if it's next to, like for example, on this picture, the balloon is next to the bag in front, uh, on the, oh, the balloon is on the the balloon is uh, next to the bag uh, on the chest of drawer. Sorry, <laughs> in English it's more difficult for me. And then also the flower are on the table, the shoes are in front. So it's important to use on, in, uh, below, everything like this. So the little words that you know, but maybe uh, your child doesn't know. 